What's up, y'all? It's your boy CJ back at you again with another video. And today, we're going to be doing things a little bit different. But before I get into that, if you're new to the channel, thank you. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. I'm CJ of Keisha Siege. If you're a returning subscriber, appreciate all the love and support. I really do thank y'all for spending time and watching these videos. So with that being said, today we're going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to try to get my boy on the channel so we can just kind of have a small discussion on why now is a great time to consider joining the military. So let me give, let me give him a call real quick. See if I can get him, get him on the channel. Hey, what's going on? Is Staff Sergeant Johns? Hey, what's up, man? It's CJ. I'm, I'm doing good. How you doing? How the family? Family's good here as well, as well. So, hey, man, real quick, I just called you because I wanted to see if I can get you on the channel and have a small discussion as of uh, why now is a great um, time to consider joining the military. Or you know what? The Army, I should say. You know what I mean? Why now is a great time to join the Army? Let's just cut straight to the chase. You think you'll be able to come through and do that for me? What you mean, man? Come on. It's just going to be a short video. It's not going to be nothing long. If you keep your answers, if you keep your, your responses short, this video won't be long. Don't get all long, Wendy. You know how you like to preach. You can do that for me? All right, cool, cool, bet. Hey, hey, come through right now. All right, all right, all right, all right, bye. So we got him coming through. Stay tuned. All right, man. Hey, thank you for coming through, man. I'm welcome, welcome, man. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you for having me. Coming from me, I don't think... Um, my input really matters as CJ, you know what I mean? So I really do appreciate you coming through, man. So, hey, welcome to the channel. Welcome to the channel, first and foremost, you know what I mean? Um, but so, yeah, just a real quick discussion. I don't I don't want to hold you long. You know, y'all recruiters, y'all busy. Y'all out here doing what y'all do. So uh, just before we even get into the questions, uh, just give a short uh, introduction of yourself. What's going on, everybody? That's on John's here. Been in the Army for a little bit over eight years. Uh, my primary job is a 91 Bravo, otherwise known as a diesel mechanic. Uh, I've been married for nine years. Me and my wife have four beautiful daughters. I've been in recruiting for almost a year and a half. And I currently recruit out of Hickson, Tennessee, um, out of the Hickson Recruiting Center. And okay. some of the things I like to do on my spare time, anything outside, Ooh. creative, arts and crafts. DIY projects. I have all daughters, so a lot of the things that I do is okay. girl oriented, nail polish, glitter, lipstick, all Ooh. of that girly stuff. So yeah. Okay. Hey, once again, thank you for inviting me to your platform, man. Cool. Yeah, I'm always okay. looking for ways to get in front of as many people possible so I can Ooh. push this okay. information to people so they know, you know, the most current information um, okay. coming from, from Army Recruiter. So thank you once again for this opportunity Ooh. to be in front of your channel and um, okay, cool. just push this information. Well, hey, you, you heard it. You heard it from him himself. You heard it. So um, moving right along. So how has life been recruiting in, in this current stage of what's life going on in Life and recruiting has right changed now. drastically. Uh, recruiters are the face of the army. So we are usually out ripping and running, coming and going, talking to as many people as possible. Okay. So when this crisis took place recruiting went to 100 percent virtual for the army me active duty army reserves now i don't know what any other okay. branches are doing all i'm speaking on is strictly army active duty and army reserves because i am an active duty army recruiter i recruit active duty that is my primary source of recruiting okay active duty so everything i'm telling y'all is strictly active duty basis uh so yeah it's 100 percent virtual we use social media platforms, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, okay. Snapchat, um, even gaming. You know, some people do gaming as a form of prospecting. Hey, anything you could do to get your face out there and talk to as many people as possible. Um, okay. You direct the, the U.S. Army Recruiting Command wants us to put forth the effort to find these people and generate leads. So that's the new norm in recruiting. Oh, I forgot one thing. Also, okay. uh, a new norm is this thing called soft contracts. If you are interested in more information about soft contracts in the Army, okay. comment below. We could do hey. a whole other video on that. That's a different that's discussion. Crazy. Got it. Uh, that's the new norm. That That is the new norm. Okay, okay. 
So, um, so from here, pretty much, um, I just wanted to know, uh, what are your three reasons behind why now is a good time to consider joining the army from you? Just what, what are your three reasons? You know what I mean? Like prioritize your reasons from, you know, of course, one being the highest priority and then okay. two and three. Three reasons why now is a good time to consider joining the army. Dang. So first and foremost, off top, I will say steady paycheck, man. Steady good paycheck, point. regardless of what goes on around Very me. Good if point. I work 15 hours a day or if I work <clears> zero <throat> hours a day, my paycheck is going to be constant. It's going to be the same unless I do something crazy that caused me to, you know, forfeit your forfeit of pay. My, my pay is, is constant. Like, that's one thing I am so glad that I am fortunate enough to be able to Continue to provide for my family with a steady paycheck, put food on the table, buy diapers for my baby girl. Like all of these things are factors that men think about or even a, a parent, you know what I mean? A, a parent thinks about to provide for their family. Like, yo, this stuff going on out here, yo, good point. bills still good do. Point. So that's going to go into my Very second point. reason, um, which is <clears throat> rent. My rent is covered. The army gives um, basic allowance for housing, and that's money straight up for your, your rent. Now, the purpose of this is to cover rent and a certain percentage of your utilities. So you have to make sure you live in below your means so that the money the army gives you, you can use it for the reasoning they're giving it to you. So uh, the money is based off of the zip code in which you live. They look at statistics and information to get and a lot of the amount of money that is required to live in that specific area. And that's how they generate how much money the army gives you for BAH. So that's my second reason. You got steady pay and your rent is covered. Hey, we cooking with Crisco. And the third one is just the education, the money to pay for education. With these, with the, the, with the crisis going on and people losing jobs, the unemployment rate is, is climbing. Um, the economy is, is going bad. I know a lot of people might say, oh, this is temporary. Things will get better, blah, blah, blah. Nobody knows right now. Everything is, is the emoji. Okay. Everybody don't, don't no, nobody knows. So um, back when I joined the army was in 2011. The last time the, the economy went down was, I think okay. it was in 2008. And from 2008 to 2011, um, I noticed the difference and fluctuation of work. Like, it was so hard to keep a job. So, the economy okay. went bad then. Hey, and that's why I joined the Army. You know what I mean? So, eight and a half years later, still going strong. Boom. We are right back in the same predicament that we were in okay. almost, what, 12 years ago. So... Um, a lot of people always say, if I join the army, I'm going to take a pay cut. When crises like this arise, you know what I mean? Like, you really have no control good over point. if a, if good a point. business is going to close or not. Very you know good I mean? point. That's, that's out of your control. So, <clears throat> um, yeah, those are my three reasons behind why I feel you should consider joining the army. You know what I mean? I'm saying army. You might say military. I'm saying army because the army is the best. The army is the best out of all the military branches you can join. The army is the best. Okay. So yeah, those are my three reasons why to consider joining the army. If you are interested in more information from me, hey, my bad, CJ. I just came through and I just dang it. Um, if you want to know more information, hey, get up with CJ. I'm pretty sure he'll coordinate it. He'll try to get me back over here. But hey, yeah, uh, you need to. Do you have any? Um, do you have any social media platforms? What are some ways uh, people in the area that you recruit, how they can reach you. All this information. I'll be putting your phone number out now. Just, social just media like platform. social media platform. Charles Johns, you type that in on Facebook. I should populate. My IG is ssg.johns. Okay. And my Snapchat is ssg underscore johns 2019. So yeah, I'll be sure to get this. Just put Got this it. information in the description below. You know? All right, well, once again, <clears throat> hey man, thank you for coming through, man. Greatly appreciate it. Uh, I ain't gonna lie. I thought you was gonna kind of, <clears throat> you was gonna tell me no, but I'm glad you um came through when you spreaded this information, man. At this specific time, uh, people need to know 
this information. And most of the time, people not really gonna look for it. They're gonna be trying to find somebody who was just trying to find avenues, or excuse me, yeah, avenues to push this information through any forms of social media just to get it out there to the masses. So once again, amen, appreciate you for coming through. Hey, thank you for having thank me. Thank you for all your hard work. Thank you for having me. Most importantly, you, thank amen, you. thank you for your service. Thank you so much. I appreciate thank you. Thank you. All right, y'all. So you heard it from him himself. Staff Sergeant Johns came through, man. Bless the channel. I'm just, man, that's my boy, man. I'm glad he came through and he spread some information because that's some information that a lot of people, they need to know and hear that information, man. It's just sitting in his back pocket. That's why I had to call him to come through and inform the masses. So if you like this video, be sure to drop a like. Hey, comment any questions that you may have in regards to um, joining the military. Uh, if you want to see Staff Sergeant Johns, come back to the channel and do an, an enlistment eligibility video. Uh, comment below as well. Hey, let him know. He'll come through and he'll talk y'all ear off. As you can see, he loves to talk. Hey, so once again, be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and I'm out.